Welcome everyone to our first ever top 5 plays for Overwatch. We have more info on what you can expect out of the series at the end, but for now we have some sick plays to show you, so let's dive into number 5. Using your ultimate in Overwatch needs perfect timing, and that's exactly what Dre shows us on Farah. Getting into position on Hollywood, he unleashes Barrage, taking 5 out of the 6 enemy team members before falling to Torbjorn's turret. Now our number 4 clip starts out a little different as Dank Memer is actually killed by Soldier 76. Watching the kill cam we don't get to see Mercy sweep in for the resurrect but we do get to see McCree come back with a vengeance as he instantly tosses out Flashbang, fans the hammer for a kill then combat rolls back for the Deadeye. He takes out 3 more members of the team with Tracer finishing off the Reinhardt. They not only secure the team kill but they secure the victory. Yeah, GG Mercy. Patience is a virtue in play number 3 as we see Tankero playing on Reinhardt. Waiting for the enemy team to approach, Mercy boosts his damage as he drops down Earth Shatter and charges forward, securing 4 kills for his team and leaving only the enemy Widowmaker alive to defend the point. Play number two proves that outplays are real as Evokia shows us one of the best parts about playing Lucio. He makes quick work of the enemy team by combining Amp It Up, Wall Ride, and his Sonic Amplifier to knock all four enemies off the side of the bridge. One more time. Oh yes, the quad kill has never looked so good. And our number one play goes to Taimo for showing us how to flawlessly play Widowmaker on Dorado. Getting ready to defend the first checkpoint, he watches for the enemy team and locates his first targets. Scoping in, Taimo first tags Zarya before setting his sights on a McCree, missing the second shot but securing the kill with a third, followed up with a quick scope to take down the airborne Lucio. Turning over, he begins a sniper battle with the enemy Widowmaker and makes it look easy. The enemy team moves up and the assault does not stop as he snipes out Lucio and finishes off a wounded Reinhardt. Infrared sights goes up and McCree gets taken down. Setting his sights on the enemy Zarya, Taimo is unable to finish her, so he drops down to join the chase. Shielded up, it looks like she might be able to get out of this one, but after a quick reload and using his grappling hook to jump through the window, Taimo lands an unbelievable snipe! If that wasn't good enough, he tags the enemy Widowmaker and snipes out the Lucio one last time. Alright, let, let's get a replay. With his infrared sights up, he tracks the Zarya while falling to land a perfect snipe between the doorway. Ladies and gentlemen, this is how it's done. With every top 5 comes a bonus clip, and this one is a prime example of how to end a game quickly. Coming all the way from Germany, 180 shows us what it takes to play a perfect Reaper game on Temple of Anubis. Make sure you pay close attention to this one guys, cause this might be one of the fastest games I have ever seen. Take note to how he always focuses on the healer first while his team cleans up the rest. So while you're watching this absolute stomp, let me take the time to introduce myself. My name is Shadow the Fallen, and I'm the caster for Potato Monster Overwatch. We know a lot of people all around the world will be playing Overwatch, so we wanted to let all of our viewers know that we would be creating content for this incredible game. For those diehard fans out there, don't worry, we won't be flooding your inbox too much. Only the first few episodes will actually be on this channel. After that, the rest will be on our second channel called Potato Monster Overwatch. Predator Monster has always taken care of you guys with top 5 league plays and we're going to do the exact same thing with Overwatch. I hope you all enjoyed our first ever top 5 plays for Overwatch. Make sure to tune in to see more episodes every week. Please be sure to like, subscribe, and submit your Overwatch plays to us in the link in the description below, or by using hashtag PotatoMonster on Plays.tv. If there is anything that you guys can think that would make your viewing experience better, then please just drop us a comment below with your feedback. Thank you so much for watching and have an amazing weekend.